السلام علیکم فرینڈ ویلکم ٹو انیدر ویڈیو ریلیٹڈ ٹو لیب ویو سو ان دی لیب ویو ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس اباؤٹ دی کلسٹر اوکے وٹ آر دی کلسٹرز اینڈ وٹ از ایڈوانٹیج آف دی کلسٹر سو دا کلسٹر ان آڈر ٹو ایکسپلین دی کلسٹر آئی ہیو جسٹ کریٹیڈ اے ویری سمپل پروگرام ہیئر بٹن ون وتھ دی آؤٹ پٹ وتھ آؤٹ پٹ ون and they, I have taken one the boolean button as a name as a string age as a uh, numeric and again boolean okay I have taken four different input and connect connected the same simple uh, output of the control to the uh, input of the indicators okay now what uh, you have to do using the cluster actually by using the cluster you can minimize the number of wiring in your block diagram uh, which look very massive when you have a lot of coding and wiring let's say here you are um, you are taking from this to this it looks like that it's a very long wiring you are doing from one point to another point so by using cluster you can minimize it how can you do that you just right click and go to cluster where is the cluster mm, let me search the cluster okay in the data containers you will find the cluster okay just click it and make it adjustment the size according to your requirement according to number of input and just drag and drop all the inputs to your cluster here H and then boolean 2 ok uh, now I just uh, remove this one uh, and I take it I adjust it from sorry here to here and let's say I make it like this and as you select the cluster in the block diagram you see this data is uh, become like this just remove all the wire control B now what can you do you just take the uh, unbundle from the cluster and class you take the unbundle and uh, the unbundle you can we have a two different type of unbundle like say this one and the unbundle by name I prefer this one unbundle by name why the reason is that I will tell you you can easily identify when you have in many number of inputs see it gives you the button one if you drag it it will give all the inputs which you have currently I have the four input so it give you button one name age and button two so uh, let's say let's say you had the input here many input here now from here to here only one wire and then where you want to connect it just unbundle it according to the name and connect it let's say boolean 1 to this one age this one a sorry name to this one age to this one and button to this one okay now now check it let's say I give the name uh, x y z give the age 45 and I make boolean 1 to high and just run it see button 1 is output 1 high xyz name is indicator uh, xyz age 45 is reflected on the indicator and button 2 is still off now if I let's say also make it high it is also high so in the bundle you can uh, 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 you clean up your wiring diagram looks very easy and you can also take this one bundle unbundle but this one is actually uh, show you without the and uh, name description but type of the data type let's say if you see uh, tf true and false showing boolean one first one abc showing the uh, string and dbl showing the double means that it is, it is the uh, integer number and again tf showing the, it is a boolean but uh, you cannot understand what is the actually if if if, if it is like that uh, i might connect this tf to output one to output uh, to output 1 and output 1 to output 2 I get confused but doing unbundle by the name make you make it sense that you can easily connect the wire to cross bonding in the 
uh, indicator okay so you can also do that okay uh, like that you can also do the bundle let's say you want to make it bundle this one and here you can input anything else let's say uh, I take one other uh, numeric control here okay uh, and I just tell him to okay now what he did uh, in existing cluster I just add one another uh, one an another uh, uh, control of numeric and now is bundle it now if I do unbundle it unbundle by the name uh, see what I what uh, what will you get you get what cluster the cluster means this one all the data and the numeric which you connected here now if you want again to uh, extend it then what you t will do you will do again unbundle by name connect it like this and now you get all the things okay the same you get here and the for that you can directly click to and create indicator okay now let's me uh, give some example let's say I make it little bit large uh, size 20 and I give here 50 okay and then uh, what is the indicator of this one here is in ending indicator mm, sorry I move it here now check you got the 50 okay but the way you design is quite different okay you uh, create bundle with existing cluster and make it separate and like that this is a many flavor you can try by yourself i hope you like the video if you like please don't forget to like subscribe and share this video thank you very much we'll meet you next video till then allah hafiz and bye